MRSA is one of the infections we hear frequently in the news. Let's talk about that. Methicillin-resistant Staph aureus, or MRSA, is an infection that we've recently heard a lot about in the community settings. And what really needs to be done is that certain initiatives need to be put into place so that patients won't become colonized or infected with MRSA. At UPMC, we've focused an initiative to reduce transmission of this organism. And the way it works is that the MRSA is transmitted in hospitals on the hands, clothes, and equipment of healthcare workers. And so if we can figure out who has this organism, we can prevent it from being transmitted to another patient. In general, we describe this as the hidden reservoir. Patients who um, appear well, they have no signs of infection, may harbor the organism. And if we can figure out that they have it, we can put into place the special interventions like gowns, gloves, and masks, and so that organism isn't passed to the next patient. So what has happened as a result of these actions? So several years ago, UPMC implemented an MRSA reduction program, again with our aim of eliminating MRSA infections. Mm -hmm. We started in one ICU, and after that intervention was in place, it resulted in an 85% reduction of MRSA hospital-acquired infections. Since that time, we've rolled that initiative out to all of the ICUs at UPMC and other high-risk areas and continue to reduce infections.